her bed in the alleyway. The concrete holds her better than her parents ever could. They could not fathom new pronouns, like they could fathom an empty bedroom and their daughter ground into sidewalk. The local shelter is not well funded. The Salvation Army will not take her. Let me tell you, it will take a long time to relearn love if she ever gets that far. He sits in a jail cell. Feeling his body shift against his bones, they tell him his hormones are a privilege, not a right. Like stand your ground is a right when the court system thinks your life is worth defending. Ask Cece McDonald. She'll tell you, you don't get far if you don't look like Zimmerman. Her name is printed under the headline. Homo face is exposed. She does not open her door when she thinks she hears someone knocking. And she always hears someone knocking they've been told to fix her to wrench and pull open the bad stitching, to sink into her like needle into flesh to sew heterosexuality. If this does not work, they can kill her. You can thank our American pastors for their pilgrimage to Uganda, for whispering in the people's ears. They came to him back to America, leaving a trail of blood in their wake. They keep teaching. We keep letting. What's the worth of queer blood anyway when it's on darker soil? I know that these stories won't make a top 20 chart. They don't sound pretty like a marriage certificate in Yan Macklemore. We might love the same, bleed the same, but some of us are bleeding out faster than others. I, I would be lying if I said I did not want to one day say, I do, I do, I do believe in the love that I have living under my fingernails from clawing in the face of everyone who has ever told me. I can't, I can't, I can't, but I will not have that declaration stand on the hot coals, the burnt out lives of the people who have been standing on my side. And as long as home is a privilege kids have been told they do not deserve, as long as gender is a privilege people have torn from their veins, as long as life is a privilege pressed into the space, pressed into bruised Bible verses until it bleeds into the spaces between the lines, I will bloom in the face break this faulty equation, because this is not equaling up, because we are still incarcerated and no one's listening, and we're still homeless, and no one's funding, and we're still lost, and no one's searching, and we're still dying, and you are still proud. Mm -hmm.